Hi guys, um, so we wanted to do something a little bit different today um, to bring you something very special. So um, me and Karen are, um, you know, we've been labelled the content queens from our private students um, and we wanted to bring to you how we ditched the hustle mm -hmm. with demand generation. Yes, let's go. <laughs> 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 so the online space has really changed we're not a uh, sorry we are in 2022 we're not in 2014 anymore um those old methods like sales calls warming webinars and cold selling the dying yeah in fact you know to be honest the six feet under the dead and the buried already <laughs> I, I am actors are jumping on these changes and taking advantage of the new trends that are creating easy, faster revenues and more time freedom within their business. So there are so many new and upcoming courses, programs and coaches that are not making the change and opting to work harder, longer and add more and more stuff to what they're already doing. So eventually um, it will force them to make changes or uh, keep them stagnant or they will just drown and disappear. So what are the changes that you're um, dying to know? Well, lots of marketers are using their feeds uh, as billboards for their programs and pushing their 10 figures mentors. And they're basically putting their leads in a free challenge um, or collecting the details to get that free thing. Um, you know, trying to get them on a 60 to 90 minute strategy call and then invest into a six to 12 weeks program that they may or may not be useful, you know, for that lead. Um, so it's a very churn and burn mentality, which worked a few years ago, but it doesn't anymore. Um, also, for someone who is working a full-time job and trying to build their online business, it is a killer. Yeah, it's unsustainable. First. Yeah, unsustainable. So the market and people are looking, looking for expert help and expertise. They crave connecting with, you know, real people, not robots, <laughs> not, um, you know, but um, they've gotten more sophisticated and more demanding. So as marketers or coaches, business people, it's up to us to meet these challenges and changes in the market or what be left behind. Yeah, I'll be left behind now. Some things will stay the same, um, but those are but those that are changing have already changed in a big way. And maybe you've noticed it right now within your business. Mm -hmm. You know, we've we've evolved since you know 2019, and and lots of prospects are doing their research on you and your competition long before they they even know who you are. Mm -hmm. And um, you know, proof of this is myself and Karen. We get a lot of messages from people that have scanned our profiles before sending a friend request. They tell us how different we are to everyone else, and and they're intrigued. Yeah. Um, boom. Um, which is <laughs> which is every market's dream. Um, and I can count on two hands, um, people that have, have never engaged on my stuff. Um, and I've not had a business conversation with yet. They've reached out to me in DM, DMs and said something like, um, hey, Claire, I'm pretty sure you can help me. I love what you're doing. You seem to be doing things um, differently. Um, and how can I get to work with you? Yeah, exactly. As you were saying, Claire, um, it, it's the kind of message that every marketers dream of um and yet what's weird is that that that's what that's not 
that's the opposite actually of what most gurus will teach you in their programs. Yeah. So this is took us completely out of the, you know, high ticket and coaching rat race. Um, most organic marketers, you know, um, are taught to add, draw people into this shiny dollar signs um, into a free thing when they can warm their leads up. And then they try to close them on a long ass calls. <laughs> Fill up the diaries with leads that may or may not invest. So it, it's, it's just that they, they're taught to play the numbers games at its finest. Yeah, yeah. It's, um, it's complete, re completely reversed now. And your potential client is, is already scrolling through your profile and checking you out. Um, they're waiting for an indication that they can truly trust you. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> you know, they're waiting for a reason to say, you know, I trust this person and, and I think they can help me. Um, so what does this mean for you and the message that you provide guys? Mm -hmm. You know, you, you need to go from general, a general message to a specific message. You know, you need to go from addressing a problem in general to addressing a specific problem that someone is suffering with right now. And going from a general sort of challenge to something that they are challenged with right now in the present. Yes. So you, you need to outline what, what that problem is costing them in part of their life. And you want to really, you know, paint a picture in your content. So it can be in your posts, in your reels, stories. You want to really show them that you have a clear and specific plan for them um, to help them remove their specific problem. Because the thing is, if someone is scrolling through your profile and they don't hear, they don't see you talking to their specific needs or challenge, if they don't see that you have a specific and clear plan to help them, um, then it will just take lo longer, you know, for you to build um, trust and it will take longer for them to feel that you can actually help them with their problem, with their very specific situation. Yeah, absolutely. Um, you see, the old way, they tried to shorten that down and um, try to shorten down the cycle by trying to push themselves on potential prospects with cold DMs, um, uninvited qualifying questions. Uh, I'm trying to push them through lots of, you know, sale like strategy calls, um, you know, which, which in return, it damages your energy mm -hmm. and it zaps your time. And really, you're not going to get the the income results that you're really working, you know, working hard for. So the thing is, people, the real serious marketers, they are far more sophisticated and they're looking at you and probably looking at others and asking, you know, does this person get me? Does this person understand my specific situation and what I am going through and more importantly do they have a plan for me mm -hmm. and they're doing this they're doing all this before they reach out to you yeah so now what what's happening is that fewer and fewer people sign up for you know for the warmer thing um mm -hmm. They don't want to jump on those sales calls anymore because everyone's energy and time is valuable, you know? So because people have learned th these old patterns and the tricks and the tactics that, you know, used to be, used to be around. Um, yeah. And, and can I just say, I, I, you know, even if you, if, even if you, I know that when, when I've invested, I've, I've looked at their profile yes. i've looked at 
can they help me and how do they help people what is their their magic and do you know i di i didn't want to go through a, a free thing i get in contact with the person that i wanted to work with and i'd be like right you know ask them a few questions and when does it start so that's even how i did things myself yeah think about how you how you feel and how you would do things yourself it's the best yes best way to to understand and um that's that's why we um i mean when when we enroll a new student uh they won't ask you know for sales calls uh they won't ask for a free thing they don't need a lead magnet we we simply you know swap a few messages in the chat in messenger and they ask for offer deeds they ask for the payment details because they're already pre-sold and pre-qualified and convinced that we can help them. So this whole strategy, it, it's just saving you a lot of time, ton of time and energy, and it's saving your prospects time and energy too. Yeah, yeah. So <clears throat> when people scroll your profile and, and on you, and, and, and your offer doesn't create demand with them specifically, and their specific situation, you're probably not going to hear from them. Yeah. So your message needs to go from general and fuzzy to specific and clear in order to build that trust and connection with someone so that the sales cycle is, is shorter, easier, and faster. <clears throat> now, which takes us to the fact that people want to take action immediately. I know I do. Um, want you know, to solve problems. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Want to get just stuck in and, and get that problem solved. No messing about. So you know, people people want to scroll through your profile, feel that you can help them, um, and all they need to know for sure is to ask you. You know, will this work for me? Mm -hmm. um, you know, they like they don't want to sign up for a, a warm up web, webinar or wait to endure, you know, sixty minute sales call. Yeah, um, that that's really what it is to endure. <laughs> yeah, endure. They're like nobody wants to be on it anyway. Like, no, um, you know, no. they're like, oh, I really just want to get started, and you're like, oh, right, sixty minutes call to to warm them up, and they're like, can we just get started? Yeah, <laughs> with a pitch at the end of it. Yeah, 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 and and no one, no one, no one likes pitching. No, let's let's face it, no one likes sales calls because they know that they are going to try and make that pitch at the end, and mm -hmm. uh, yeah, and it, and it, it, it it's awkward and icky. Uh, <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, so yeah, so you know they do want to sign up to a warm up webinar and enjoy that sixty minutes call. Because they've already done the research, you know, they've already they're already eighty percent sure that you're the right person for them. Um, they may just have a you know a few questions that um, they need answering before they get started. Exactly, because what they want is access to you and your offer, but they, they want it right now. I mean, it, it, it's they're ready, you know, they're ready to get started. So. They don't want to wait and see through all the warm steps. Like they just want to know when does it start, how much is it, and what's the payment details. So if you're still running people through webinars, sales calls, uh, cold messaging, cold calling, um, if you're still in that rigid old way of doing sales, you're losing a ton of opportunities right now that could be, you know, that you could be getting back simply allowing people to jump in your DMs, engage in a chat, see if they qualify, send them the offer or voice note and um, answer their specific questions so that you can actually help them with, with their problem, with their present problem. Um, the process of taking people from post to sales call is losing you hot, ready to buy 
um, people. Is, I, I don't like to call them leads. <laughs> so yeah, <laughs> yeah it's, it's losing you um, people every day. So the best quality and the best, you know, ideal client act fast and they don't want to wait. Yeah. Um, people are closing, you know, 5K plus deals through chat. People are buying cars, uh, houses online. <laughs> True. I think I think I think more people spend money online now than in shops, don't they? Yeah. <laughs> <That's right. laughs> so, guys, um, yeah, if you want to incorporate sales chat into your business, which I really suggest that you that you that you do, um, you know, reach out, um, reach out to us, um, and so last but not least, bonus. This is actually a bonus tip. So, um, <laughs> you know, um, people already trusted you can deliver and solve their current situation because they've, they've invested in you and they're ready to go. So why should they wait 12 weeks of training just to get that result if you can solve that in just one week? Oh, my God, 12 weeks. <laughs> Yeah. exactly exactly <laughs> you know they want it solved quickly so if you want to attract more motivated clients you know clients that will actually do what you want them to do um clients who are enthusiastic clients that don't waste time and they just you know they just get to work they just implement um then you want to structure your offer to give them a fast result. Yeah. So the result for you is you will attract ideal clients that have more money than time. I'll say that again. The result for you is you'll attract ideal clients that have more money than time. And it allows you to demonstrate your very best work and wow your clients and to give them your magic super quickly. Yes. And that's exactly what Claire and I can help you doing. Um, pinpoint, pinpoint that ideal client that you can help right now and build your six-figure audience. We can help you dial in that message from general to specific. So when people are scrolling on your feed, when people are watching you, you build that trust more quickly with them. And uh, it just shortens you know, the, the sales cycle a lot. So we can also help you insta install sorry, a sales chat framework that is personal to you and to your offer services so that you can enroll without sales calls. Um, it's the outcome for you. You find your sales opportunity double by people reaching out to you on chat and not having to deal with chasing or scheduling calls and all that, you know, Jesse crap. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And the outcomes for the client, faster results, um, because they're, they're getting the specific problem solved in, in a, in a, you know, quick way. Absolutely. Absolutely. So, you know, if you don't want to do sales calls, you have um, a full-time job or, um, and you're trying to build, you know, your online business around that, you're sick and tired of adding a ton of people and having you know 30 plus cold conversations a day with people who are never going to buy from you um if you're following like a robotic script that makes you feel sticky and icky mm -hmm. or you know you're re you're relying on your mentors to close for you and and if you can relate to what we explained and want to save yourself a ton of time and a ton of energy and most importantly, you want to close deals and break away from the high ticket rat race and have fun doing so. Mm -hmm. Then, guys, where are your golden girls? 
<laughs> well, you content queens, you golden girls. Um, so feel free to, you know, to reach out to us for a chat. Yeah. Yeah. We absolutely. promise. We promise uh, we won't bite. Seriously. <laughs> well, Karen gets hungry sometimes. <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> so guys um yeah ciao for now bye